Okay. 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 Like here that. we go. No, yeah. no, it's like that. I got it. Yeah. Let me hold Sorry, on a second. second. Are we gonna do the same thing? Well, I am. I don't know what All you're right, doing. Okay. I'm doing this. <laughs> the beauty of live theater is that. In the end, you can't control all of it, that there is an element of wildness to it, that the more you try and organize it, the more potential there is for chaos. And yeah, I think we can probably come up with, you know, we can think of many examples of where things have gone wrong. A prop is missing, uh, someone doesn't make their entrance. Yeah. Uh, I was left on stage for almost two minutes without a scene partner <laughs> once on stage. Who was yeah. to come on? I'm not gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't um, me. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, that's, that's the beauty of live performance. Yeah, you never yeah. know what's gonna happen. Yeah, I feel like so many of those th things that happen in the show have happened at different times, but just never all at once. The show is like the perfect storm of the things happening wrong. Yeah. The whole play is like a big bait and switch. It's like we set up in the first act how this play is supposed to be acted out by the company and then we see two examples of how it unravels and it gets progressively worse each time. Each act seems to get deeper into absurdism in terms of the disintegration of the piece. Yeah. And yeah, it, the deeper it goes, the funnier it gets, it feels yeah. like. Yeah. <laughs> no, I think these kinds of shows are really great for actors because they're just, they give you the perfect excuse for like, Behaving bad as badly behavior. as possible. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, it's the best. It's an excuse to behave badly yeah. on stage. It's and we've also cool. talked about Lloyd being kind of the straight man of the piece in certain yeah. ways, right? Which has yeah. been really fun to explore. Well. Yeah, that's been that's been, that's been the biggest challenge. Is um, is wanting is there's a part of me that because I love farce so much. There's a part of me that just like wants to do all the things and wants to be a part of the craziness and having to pull back and be like, no, 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 no. This is you're the straight man. Play that. But it's great. It's been a really fun challenge.